I am Dr. Natasha Ross. I am a senior lecturer at the Department of Chemistry at the University of the Western Cape. My research field is to construct and design special types of nanoparticles so that we can place them in solar chargeable batteries, which we can use in the medical field, we can use it in agriculture for transportation, and so doing really we also targeting specific key challenges that is addressing global strategic goals. So my passion is to make sure that electricity is produced from the sun and that we do not harm the environment. Because if we have small gadgets, looking at our cell phones, our laptops, smart devices, usually it runs out of battery power quickly. So what we have to do is then we discard it, but what my role is as a scientist to make sure that we develop batteries, that we do not need the grid, we do not use fossil fuels, we use the energy from the sun. When we do discard it, it does not harm the environment. It is biodegradable as well. So what is exciting about my job? I mean, everything. Um, I get to lecture. First and foremost, I'm a lecturer, I get to teach, I get to inspire young minds, and I get to incorporate what I do in the lab so they can see where the lecturing, where the knowledge of what we teach them, where it fits into the real world. Coming back into the lab, I get to do groundbreaking research. So it's research that is making a difference in society. It's not just because I want to keep busy. Yes, I'm, an, I'm a scientist, I'm an, a chemist, I like cooking things up, but we want to make sure that what we do is actually contributing to the world of science. And knowing that I'm making a contribution is very fulfilling. So for this job, you need to have a passion for, for learning, you need to be creative, proactive, and just have a love for adventure because learning science is an adventure. And also don't be afraid to fail because that's your first attempt in learning. I always say failure is an acronym for first attempt in learning. It's not going to be smooth sailing, but you're learning throughout the process and you need to bounce back, you need to be resilient because you know what your goal is, you want to make a difference. And through science, we can do that. There was one student who asked me, so if everything, we're lecturing these textbooks, the reality tables are already there, has everything already been discovered? No, that's the smiling. There is so much more that we can discover. We can be in the forefront of, of knowledge. You are the next trailblazer. So if anything comes to mind, if there's anything in society where you can think of that's a, that's a problem, you have the power through science to come up with a solution and make things better.